All right, today's video, we're going to be making our modification to the 2.5 Cobra. This is going to be a little bit more condensed, which means that when I made my prototype, I had it the same length. We're going to end up having to make it a little bit longer than we did with the previous video. 2.5 Cobra is a little bit more flat than the modification. Modification is just going to backtrack on the pattern rather than continuing it down. What are we going to need for this video? We're going to need 8 foot of orange, 10 feet of green, some pliers, 5 8 inch buckles, scissors, and a fid. Let's get started. My green cord is the 10 foot cord. I'm gonna put my fit on it. And I like melting my cord when I'm putting the fit on. So it's the shape of the fit. Again, our four strands down the middle are gonna be called our core. This is our left working end. Here's our right working end. Take the left working end, go over the core. Next, I'm going to take the fid, pass it through the left loop. We're going to make a square knot. Tighten that up. And we're going to try not to have any of the core strands overlap. So if you have them start overlap, that means you got it too tight. Next, take the right working end, which is our orange end now. Pass that over the core. Now I'm going to bring my left cord over all the orange. I'm going to separate three core strands on the left, one on the right. Next, I have to loosen this up, the knot we just did. I'm going to have three on the left, one on the right. Pass it underneath and through. Now I'm going to separate three on the right and the left for the core. Pass the fid underneath and through the right orange loop. I'm going to backtrack first, go to that first knot I did, tighten that up. Now I'm going to take this middle cord right here, which is on my green, pull on that. I'm going to hold that tight a little bit. Now I'm going to take the left orange cord, pull that tight, hold it in place. I'm going to take the green cord, pull on that. I'm going to try to rearrange these, make sure these are not overlapping. 
Now we have a small little bit to work with. I'm going to loosen this up right here. I have to retighten every anything I, I will. Next, take the orange working end over the four core strands. My green end here. Separate three core strands on the right, one on the left. I set underneath and through this loop right here I just made earlier. Now I'm going to separate three core strands on the left, one on the right. Take my FID, pass it through that separation. And that's going to go through the orange loop here. Let's tighten up our knot. Go back to our second knot we made. Tighten that up. Take the green cord that's down the middle, tighten that up. Take your orange cord, pull on that. Take the green working end, pull on that. Now I start to have our alternating pattern right here. Take my FID. A small little part of real estate trying not to let this knot come undone by holding my thumb there pull it out about a half inch take my orange end working end put it over the core take my green cord over separates three on the right one on the left of the core as a fid through that opening. Separate the core, three on the right, one on the left. Pass the fid through, and then through the orange loop. Start tightening it. Take the orange up in the upper right. Pull on that. Then take the green. It's in the middle. Pull on that. Next, the orange on the left. Pull on that. And then the green. Pull on that. We're going to loosen up this part right here. A half inch to an inch. The orange working end, place it over the core. Move my green cord so it doesn't get knotted up. Separate three core strands on the right, one on the left. Take my FID, pass it through that opening and then through that orange small loop. Three core strands on the left, one on the right. Take the FID, pass it through that opening in the core, and then through the left orange loop. Tighten this up, starting with the upper left hand corner on the orange cord, holding that in place, pulling on the green cord that's in the middle. Then we have our orange cord on the right. And then our green cord that's on the left. One.
take our fid. Inch loop. Take the orange cord on the right. Place it over the core. Move my green cord over the left or over the orange cord. Working end. I'm gonna separate the core three on the right. Uh, sorry, three on the left, one on the right. Place this underneath and through. This over. Separate the core. Three on the right, one on the left. Place the fit through, and then through the orange loop. Let's tighten this up. Upper right hand corner. Pull on that one. Then we're going to pull on this one right here. The left cord we're going to pull on. Then the right cord. Okay, we're trying not to overlap these core strands. I'm going to use my FID, loosen up this part right here to about a half inch. Take my left working end, place it over the core. Take my green cord over the orange cord. Separate three core strands on the right, one on the left. Pass my FID through that opening and then through this small orange loop. I'm going to separate the core again, three strands on the left, one on the right, pass the fit through that opening, and then through the orange loop on the left. Take these up, pull on this top one on the top left, then the one in the middle. right and the one on the left we can see the pattern
we're trying it on. There's the front and there's the back. Good, let's finish it off.